here we are. One wit and one shay, no rye rye. Uh, last week we had a bit of a family situation, but now we're all good. Everybody's good. Everybody's better than ever, actually. Yes. Um, so now we are ready to take this on. Rai Rai will be back next week for the finale finale. But Mama Shay has graciously stepped in for us tonight. So let's get this show on the road. <laughs> uh, when we left off, Gabby had chosen Erich. Yeah. Rachel had done that weird thing with Zatch and told him that he was too young for her, basically. <laughs> He's one year younger. <laughs> so he had pulled her aside at the rose ceremony, right? All right. And there are three left, and then he was like, may I speak with you? And then Jesse Palmer was like, we can't continue. It's going to get too dramatic from here. So right. we're ready, Jesse. Yep. Let's do it. The most talked about finale we've ever seen. Really, Jesse? Do you believe him? Yes, I do. Oh, she's buying it. Wow, Gabby's hair. Oh, my goodness. So many extensions and so much going on there. I love it. Yeah, it looks really good. The most dramatic finale in Bachelorette history. And it starts right now. Oh, I've heard that before. All right, we're going back to the rose ceremony where I got married, by the way. <laughs> yes, that is. I felt like I was seeing Bachelorette Rachel, not the real Rachel that I come to know and love. It's not so backwards, though. He, he was saying that when the cameras were off, she was right. putting on a show. Yeah, it doesn't make sense. Yeah, I didn't really love you. Oh, oh in the past. Oh, God, months. that was fast. It was. That's very fast. He's I, over it. I guess. I need to go. Good for you, Zatch. Look how red his ears are. He's very agitated. But I think he made the right choice. I she must to. have made it so clear in the fantasy suites. You're not ready, right? 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 Because she's not into him. So she wanted him to make yeah. the decision maybe for himself. Probably. I, yeah, I I didn't see that part. Did you no, see No, no, no. They didn't show it. But he, when he was talking to Captain Turd, Jesse, the next day, <laughs> he said... Okay. She kept saying, you're so, are you, you're so young, are you sure you're only 25? She's 26. And she kept asking, are you sure you're ready? Are you sure? Gotcha. So. Oh, wow, no love lost between them. I feel badly for him. The license plate looks like a sad face. <laughs> <laughs> Honestly, this is so sad. When I'm super devastated about something, I generally just say to myself, this is super sad. <laughs> this is just real sad. For people who especially say that they care about me to kind of take things into their own hands and question my character, it's obviously really disappointing. I don't really have any other words. He did not do that. He did not do that. Did he do that, though? No. <laughs> Questioned her character? No, he did not. She made me feel... ...like special. Oh. Caveman have feelings too. Is I'm he kidding. Gonna be the next batch. I don't know. I was just thinking, is he dynamic enough, or is he a little too robotic? I'm not sure, but I think all of our hearts are breaking for him right now. Yeah, he's very handsome. Would you date him? Mm. Seventy-five years ago. <laughs> <laughs> you bitch. Um. Uh, I'm. I, uh, I don't know. I might have dated him, but there is something about his personality. That That's I, a little stiff. Yes. So. Not in a good way. <laughs> right, right. That was for you. <laughs> <laughs> oh, Zach. He's very handsome. He is. Got a haircut. Got a strong jawline. Looking fresh. I do apologize for ever making you feel like I called you out for your character. Don't you apologize. <laughs> do you have any regrets? No regrets. That was a very like, sorry, sorry, you're fine, you're fine, it's okay, it's okay, moment. A bit blah. Very. That looks like an outfit that she will wear on Dancing with the Stars. I have a family and two best friends who are very opinionated. I am gonna go get Avon. Okay. <laughs> sorry. <laughs> I'll just leave it to you, Whitley. She's giddy. <laughs> Remember when they, their Clayton season? Yes. When they, the, each girl came back after their night with him. Yeah. And they were sitting right there. They had to endure. They had to be awkward yes. together. They don't do that to the men, do The they? men, no, the men are in different Ooh, locations. Ooh, the men probably each get their own villas. It just pisses me off. Right to them. Pisses me off. Right to the producers. It's, it's wrong. In cursive. It's wrong <laughs> in shorthand. 
You're right though, that's a very good point. It's, it's I was, that was wrong. He's got a box of why? Avon seems much more genuine. Yes. And yes. tolerable than Tino. I don't know, something about Tino seems a little bit volatile. Well, his parents, for well, God's that sakes. that too, holy cow, I forgot. Yeah. yeah. Oh, sweaty pit, oh, McGee. He really is. We've like done a lot together up until this point. Tony's like, what do you mean you've done a lot together? <laughs> Mom is just, <laughs> She's not just... saying a word. <laughs> She's happy to be there. Yeah. Let's go talk. <laughs> I'm gonna get you in the kneecaps. <laughs> So what are you going to say today that's going to make me remember you? It was like a job interview. <laughs> I can like 1000% see myself getting there. Do you have enough time to get there? I don't know. I don't know how much time we have left, but I am falling in love with her and my feelings are very strong. Oh, they're showing us her reaction. This makes me feel like he's not going to be able to propose. I love seeing you that happy when you walk above the ground. Oh, when you walk above the ground. <laughs> um, they're still showing her, so yeah, something's, something's going on. Weird. It's just about the timing of it. Mm -hmm. Have you said that to her? Have you said I've that, like, I've I don't know that, that I want to get engaged at the end of this? What's this guy's name? Because I love him. What this BFF of hers. Who's like, know. have you said that to her, sir? Well, it bothers me that all she's thinking about is an engagement. I think that's stupid. Well, that's sort of the point. Well, of the I show. know that's the point of the show, but of course, in the real life, that's dumb. But yeah. this is not real life. This is the bachelor <sighs> world. Get with it, Shay. If she comes home not engaged, that's going to be really hard. He's tougher than Tony. I know. This is like shocking. Like I really thought he was like gonna sit down with you and be like 100. percent Yeah, no, he wasn't like that. Whoa. Yeah. No. He's 100 percent for her. He just d doesn't want to jump into a, an engagement. Why do some women have to get engaged? I mean, like this is the Bachelorette. What? Shay Shay. I don't understand it. This is the Bachelorette. <sighs> I'm gonna end the sentence there. Okay. <laughs> So let's chit chat. The conversation I had with Nate and Sam. And yeah, how'd that go? It went so well. No, oh, really. Okay. Like they're so happy to see me. So happy. Yeah. I guess like I'm like a little bit like concerned. What? The like muffs. Oh well, yeah. But it's just I'm liking just... up a storm. I just still can't get over this. But go ahead. Can't get over what? The fact that she's demanding. Yes. I know, of course, it's ridiculous in the real world. But in this world, it's okay. We give it a pass. We lose our minds for this. I do feel like I'm ready to get engaged. I just want to make sure that it's right. I'm so confused. That's not what you told me. I want nothing more than to be with you after this. Oh, they've got her in the corner again, looking real unhappy. Straight into a commercial after that very heated moment. What should she do, Shay? <laughs> Don't say what you normally say. No, I'm saying it to him. Walk away. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> That's all she has on her head. I, I, I'm gonna get engaged. She I'm wants her fairy tale in front of millions of people. She wants to not look like a, the fool who didn't complete her goal. I mean, she's 26. I know, trust me, I get it. You were 52. <laughs> <She doesn't get laughs> what did that make you? <laughs> I wanted you to walk in there and like be like 100%. She is spoiled. She's obviously had everything her way. You know what I'm saying? Big Tony's been spoiling her. I think so. And she, she, she she can't understand what he, for God's sakes, he's, he's so smart. He's, what he's trying to say to her. I know. He's explaining it in a good, in a he, great way. He is. You told me you were ready for an engagement. I am ready. But if he did tell her that in private, it is very annoying for him now to be like, no, I meant I'm ready in my life. I didn't mean I'm ready to get engaged to you right now. Well, we'll I never mean, know what maybe. I know, but I'm just saying if that's true, then I understand her situation. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know. It's all stupid, she's of course. She's making him mad is what she's doing. Oh. 
I do not want to ever see you upset, especially if it's like me making you upset. Like I can't. Who is she? I don't know, but they are not buying what he's saying. The audience seems to be team That's Rachel. That's ridiculous, people. I'm here for you, okay? I am. I want to be with you. Uh-huh. Uh -huh. Yeah, I gotta go. She's not hearing anything that he has to say. Exactly. She's, she's like canceled him already. I, know. I gotta go. She's like, Tino's coming in. I know. Second string, let's go. I don't know why we're live with them when we're just cutting straight to commercial each time, but all right. Okay, you just go ahead and lean out of frame whenever you want. <laughs> I had an itch I needed to scratch. I feel like everybody here honestly is a little bit shocked. Oh, God bless America. All right, let's get to some fun. Yeah, Gabby's turn. Oh, that's her dad. That's her was, dad. He was just holding the signs last time. Now he's actually here. So Eric is the only one that I want you guys to meet. Am I right in thinking this is, I mean, I know you're no bachelorette historian, but this is the first time in either bachelor or bachelorette history where there's only one left at this point. Right? Well, um, the few times that I've watched it. No, yeah, I think you're right. It's, this is rare. Unprecedented. There we go. I'm grateful to have a dingbat, beautiful granddaughter. <laughs> <laughs> That's so true. <laughs> you know, I, I am obsessed with her. And I think she's an amazing person. And I love it when guys are obsessed with my daughter. <laughs> I just love her. I want the best for her. Oh, Gramps and another commercial break. Tired of dating married guys who drive around in a creepy old van? Do better. Oh, a creepy old van? Yes. Okay. There's a lot of chatter right now on social media about Grandpa John for Bachelor. And what happened to the senior show? Bring it back. <laughs> I fell for Tina really early, but Tino's family doesn't like me. That's like a horrible way to go into meeting someone. Uh -huh. How you doing? Nice to meet you, sir. <laughs> How you doing? Uh, so, yo, know, we, uh, we kind of like caught each other's eye really early and I'm in love with her and I can't wait till you guys all get to know me a little bit better. <laughs> He's so awkward. Do you think you guys have enough in common? Yeah. <laughs> yeah, I do. I know that means a lot to her to have family who, you know, especially who likes her. <laughs> He's like, oh, so she told she you. She told ya. <laughs> Here we are back in those chairs. Tell me a little bit about the hometown. You know, what happened there that changed her mind or? Uh, was that a slip? Yeah, I don't know. I do like you. That's a little bit in awe of how well meeting Rachel's family just went. After his family situation, he should. Yeah. I'm still not Team Tino. No. I don't know. What were you hoping for? What did you need to hear from Avon? Uh, will you marry me? <laughs> All right, back to Avon, their last date. I am so, like, deeply sorry about making you feel like that. The next step in all of this is so important to me because I care about you. But, you know, realizing... Look at her looking over at Gabby. He just said, but... Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. I hate okay, you. hurry up, hurry up, hurry up. <laughs> I gotta go. When I sat down with Sam and Nate and they looked at me and said, you don't know where he's at right now? Do you know how that felt to me? I thought that we were on the same page. So she's more humiliated than I think disappointed. That's what it sounds like to me. I think she feels lied to. I might have been, I don't know what it is, caught up a little bit. Uh -oh. What does that mean, caught up? <laughs> just made it worse. I can't, like, move forward. So she went from, this is the most amazing man I've ever met. I want him to propose to me and be my husband forever. Right. To, you can't propose to me right now, it's over. Exactly. <laughs> time for the salad. No. Did he say, I don't have time for this? <laughs> time for the salad. No. Oh, I didn't intend for this to happen. Uh -oh. <laughs> I don't have time for this. You dodged a bullet there, even. Oh, that was crazy. She's like, ah, 
skippity doo da. It's just like hard to know it's over. All right, goodbye montage. So now she's only left with one as well, whose family hates her, so this should be great. <laughs> that must be really emotional to watch back. I can see the emotion on your face. Her very glossy lips have taken all my attention. <laughs> This has been one massive roller coaster for you, and obviously tonight's no different. <laughs> what was that? Please, I'm glad you noticed that too. Little bunny, boop, 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 I've been through it before. <laughs> I'm extremely, extremely sorry. So she's had two great guys apologize to her. Mm -hmm. This is ridiculous. <laughs> You're so anti-Rachel. I am. I wasn't. Before tonight, but I, 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 I think I've seen the true Rachel. You've seen the light. Yeah. Okay. I could see Avon as Bachelor more than mm -hmm. Zach. Mm -hmm. In the fantasy suite, you told Rachel that you were ready for an engagement. So what changed? What happened? Good question, Jesse. You know, ultimately, I, I thought that we could have gotten there. You know, if we would have continued on. Do you feel like her friends sabotaged your relationship with Rachel? <laughs> Absolutely not. We're the There's red flags. <gasps> we don't have our flags. How did we go this whole episode? I'm looking Almost. around for them. We got them, folks. We got them late. <laughs> We're a little discombobulated <laughs> over yes, here. I'm flagging Rachel. <laughs> he was doing what was best for him, and my feelings were always there. I mean, it just was kind of, we weren't on the same page. It's like televised melatonin. This is what she needs. She needs a man that's going to kowtow. Is that a word? Mm hmm To every whim. That's what she needs. And that's I what she needs? Or does she just want that? Well, that's what she wants. Yeah. And I hope Tino's ready. If she picks Tino. Well, true. we shall see no. Okay. <laughs> okay. Dead horse is beaten, maybe move on. <laughs> Talk about milking this for all it's worth. Holy two episodes for why. I do want to spend the rest of my life with you. I don't want to rush anything and I don't want there to be any expectations or anything that wouldn't be natural to us. What did he just say? Uh, wait, what you mean, bro? <laughs> I'm not the one proposing and that's why like, I don't know. We kind of like see maybe. I mean, she's more rational about it. You know, she's not like getting upset and getting angry with him. She doesn't have any other options either, so she kind of has to just go with it. <laughs> He's basically saying the same thing. Let's just do what feels right, and I don't know if that's a proposal right now. I just like I want to be you. I want to what? Be you? I think I just want to date you. He didn't say date. He said be you. Mother. <laughs> I just want to be you, Gabby. This isn't Silence of the Lambs. It's not going to peel her skin off of the Well, wire. I don't think he said, I just want to date you. Yes, he did. Oh. I just like I want to date you. Date you. In the real world, like I want to date you. Like in the real world, like oh, I, mean, I am. Want to. Okay, I need my hearing aid turned up. <laughs> <laughs> that doesn't scream, I want to propose. <laughs> no, it does not. How is this whole thing going to end? Next week, people are going to murder each That's other. It. Strap in, Mama Shay. Because we're going for a terrible ride. Tina truly is the man of my dreams. Now Tina's the man of her dreams? Okay, all right. He said, I want to leave here and I want to date you. Or be you. <laughs> is that what I thought she said? Yes. <laughs> Which makes no sense. All right, wait, what's Tina saying here? <laughs> oh no, we've lost her, folks. I'm red flagging you. <laughs> my only red flag of the night. Oh my god. Why would... <laughs> that would be pretty stupid. <laughs> he wants to be the bachelorette. <laughs> Clean the eyes and lie to me again. You did say that. Honestly, I think he might walk away. Uh, I don't think any of them should be getting engaged. I don't either. There, it is an end of the show now. Dumpster it, fire. It was a failure. The it's end. Ridiculous. Holy cow. Are we too harsh? No. This looks awful. I mean, it's entertaining, I guess, for people, but I don't 
care to watch that. They're gonna fight and then. Is he gonna propose to me? I know. After we have such a horrible relationship. Exactly. Rachel looks miserable right now. What was that? That was about 30 minutes of content stretched into two hours and 16 minutes. So thank you, ABC, for that. <laughs> Don't know what to say. There's not much to say. I feel like these relationships that remain don't have a solid foundation. Well, no. As none of them usually do. But sometimes they, you know, there's a lucky connection that solidifies them early. They don't have that. So we should just call it a day. Yeah. But next week, Rai Rai will be back. Yes. Yay. Rai Rai will be back. Yeah. Mama Shay will not be and here. And I know I'm getting the day off. She'll be here in spirit. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you for filling in. You're welcome. I was a little down tonight. I was a little negative. I'm sorry, but I got a little irritated at Rachel. <laughs> so you're being honest. That's just all we can yeah, promise but, every single week. Yes, that's true. That's true. That's true. But anyway, I hope I wasn't too much of a downer for you people. Y'all have a great week. And you too. Thanks, Mama. You're welcome. Mama. All right, let's red flag it on out of here. Um, all right. Thanks yes. for watching. Bye, guys.